I'm Ross Henry with the Kimberly Animal Hospital. Many times when we're discussing surgeries with our clients, the number one concern arises about the use of anesthetics. So I'd like to go over some of the precautions that we take to prevent an adverse event from occurring. Now one of the first things we do as we're preparing a dog for surgery is we place them on a water bed. Now in my opinion, the number one cause of an adverse event occurring is because the body temperature gets too cold. Now this is a water bed, it's heated, it's, it gets your body up off of the stainless steel table and you've got it covered by a towel. So this will help ensure that you rest comfortably during the procedure and that her body temperature stays normal. The second thing we do is we place an IV catheter in it. Now the IV catheter is a direct portal into the body. So if something happens and we need to administer medications quickly, we've got a direct avenue into the body. Now, if we have an adverse effect, one of the first things that happens is the blood pressure drops. And so you can't fumble around trying to find a vein at that time, it's too late. So we've already got the catheter in place. So if something does happen, we can immediately get inside the body with medications as needed. Another thing we do is we hook them up to an um, electronic monitoring device. But this will monitor her electrical activity of her heart, the oxygen saturation, and her blood pressure. And sometimes when we're having an adverse effect, before the event occurs, we'll pick up subtle changes here. And so we can correct the anesthetic as needed during the procedure. And finally, we have her on an anesthetic delivery device. This ensures that she's getting adequate oxygen, ensures she's breathing the right number of breaths per minute. And if there is a problem, we can immediately turn off the anesthetic and she's on straight oxygen. And also we have a nurse directly related to monitoring her during this whole procedure. So not only is she watching the ECG machine and the anesthetic delivery device, but she's gonna be checking the patient on a regular basis to ensure the heart's doing fine, she's got good gum color, there's no lung, fluid accumulation. So all these precautions we take to help prevent an adverse effect and to ensure the safety of your pet during a procedure. I'm Ross Henry with the Kimberly Animal Hospital.